Ah, now, oops. So I'm doing this forgetfully. Coming up later in this video. But that would have kept you reasonably intrigued, so that's a good thing. Excuse me, folks, I'm experiencing technical difficulties with my tips. Just the tips. But first... Hello everyone, Katobi here. Thank you very much for joining me and everyone else <laughs> for today's amazing painting. I am really looking forward to doing this one. This is the second last painting I am doing in the third season of um, my journey, of my, my acrylic art journey, yes. <laughs> so this is the second last painting I'm doing, but it'll be the second painting that you see in season three. So basically you could say I've done a lot of practice up until this point and I, I hope this works. I, I'm a little bit nervous. Um, let me run you through the colors and what I've done to this point and then we'll get going. So I've already covered the canvas with the white. So that's uh, white paint and my uh, pouring medium that I'm working on. Uh, once I've covered the canvas, I then tilt it out, use a hairdryer, blow it out, and then I top up the sides. Now the sides have already been covered. Uh, I paint them well in advance of doing these um, beautiful demonstrations. And so we've got the white paint. We've also got my black, uh, which is my swiping medium black, violet, ultramarine blue. We've got my blue purple um, that I made up myself. We've got a green, which is the uh, uses the world's greenest green, but a little bit of another type of green and white. So pastel green. Uh, we have a yellow with mica powders in it. I'll leave a link in the description um, and there should be a card on screen for what those mica numbers mean. It's got number three and 17 in it, that yellow. Uh, we have orange and that has mica powder six in it. And we also have my red, which has mica 23 in it. And um, I'm gonna pop that there. Let's get into it. So this is gonna be pretty. Uh, I'm going to start with red. There we go. Hey, finally, yellow. Ah, now, oops. So I'm doing this forgetfully, but that would have kept you reasonably intrigued. So that's a good thing. Work with me. Excuse me, folks, I'm experiencing technical difficulties with my tips, just the tips. I'm excited to see how this one goes. This is my swiping medium, uh, this black. It's got uh, flow troll and black paint, that's it. So it's gonna go there, it's gonna go there, and all on its own. Now clearly I have made a very big error with the uh, distribution of the colors. Probably should have worked my way in Oh well, <laughs> here we go. So um, I was going to blow that way as I went along. I don't think I'm going to do that now. I think actually I'm going to blow out this way and yeah, hopefully happy accident. All right, let's do this. It was a happy accident. Just need a blow just here. Oh, scary. Cool. Oh my gosh. We did a thing. We did a beautiful thing. Okay. That wasn't what I intended to do. Um, I like what I've done instead. Just quick torch. I'm not gonna mess with that. Not a single hair. No hairs, Mellow. Oh my gosh, there's actually a single hair. Are you kidding me? All right, well, hopefully that's 
it then. Um, that's gorgeous. I, I hope you're loving that too. Let me bring you in. Uh, this will be a short flyover. Uh, sorry, close up. All right, once I've done this close up, you will see this lovely piece of artwork in the future, for my future. You'll be speaking with uh, Katobi from the future and you'll see it varnished and dry. So I hope, um, yeah, I hope you enjoy seeing this dry. I know I'm going to be excited to see what it looks like dry too. Thanks for watching this portion of the video. Happy accidents. Happy accidents, isn't it? I, uh, I'm still going to revisit this one, but as the up and down blowing. But for now, this is the gorgeous artwork we have, and I definitely want to revisit this. So the ones that I think are above um, the average, uh, I will definitely revisit in the future. So we'll, we'll revisit this one. Um, there's a few artworks that I want to do different... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Different science on? No, that's not the word. Different experimentations. I want to do different experimentations on certain aspects. And uh, I think this would be a wonderful one to do those experimentations on. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching the second episode of season three. Uh, this was the second last painting that I painted. Uh, I hope you like the editing style of the previous part of the video. Skipping from, um, you know, lifting up the paint and showing me lifting it up and then changing the scene and then me going to the, you know, just straight to the swapping of the paint, sometimes putting it down if that was rel relevant because of what I was saying. Um, let me know if that makes any difference to the viewing experience to you. Uh, I'm under the impression that some people say, how long should the video be? And the impression is it should be long enough to convey the message but not any longer. So that's what I'm trying to do for you. Um, and this one came up reasonably quick, actually. I think I've rambled enough, enough now. Um, I, I love this one. Um, it's one of my favorites. <laughs> and uh, enjoy the flyover that's gonna happen next.